This is an app we've created using custom business object. Let's press go here to get a list of all the fine beers we've entered. Let's search for a shoe. Press go. Here we see all the details of the shoe, and by pressing edit, we can modify each field. Let's change the tasting notes to a must try beer for the summer. Press save. Go back. Now let's sort it on brewery and filter on only the Belgian beers. There we go, we got a list of Belgian beers. All right, let's show you how we created this app. We select custom business object, select new, enter the name of our app, my beer app, create, We select some standard features, which will automatically create some standard fields. By going to the field tab, we can enter new fields. Let's call this brand. It's a text field and make it 30 characters long. And we set it to the first position. Let's add another one. Type. Also 30 characters long. Now we could create the brewery field. Make this 50 long. Country. Twenty five characters. And the type. Now, here we select a code list. We have to select a code list here, and we already created this code list using the custom reusable elements app. Now we create a website field and we can select the web address type. And the tasting notes. Make this a long one, 200 characters. The last thing we need to do is select primary keys and press publish. Now the system is creating all the necessary objects to make this My Beer app work. So next to the tables, classes, and CDS views, an OData service is generated as well. All we need to do is activate this. So in SAP GUI, we go to the Maintain Service Transaction, and then we select Add Services. Here we select Codeployed, and then we search for something with beer. And there it is, we select it, and then we press add service. Put it in local object, press OK, and there it is, it's activated, ready to be used in a Fiori app.